Hey, uh, today we will be working on a question related to the Brayton Joule cycle. Now, the Brayton Joule cycle uh, is rather unique uh, when compared to the other air cycles that we have been um, observing. The other air cycles that we have been observing, if you notice, we have been using our closed systems. However, the Brayton Joule cycle, while it can be used for closed systems, is actually also used for open systems. In um, and the most common uh, application of it is in this kind of arrangement here and it is this is called the gas turbine uh, arrangement so what happens in this gas turbine arrangement is that we have state one over here where the air enters a compressor And so therefore, our work is going to go into the system over here. Then after it hits the compressor, it goes to state 2. And then it uh, there's some sort of a heat reservoir over here. Oh, and uh, maybe you can call it a boiler if you like. But what happens over here is um, some heat is in inserted into the system. Then at state 3, the uh, air enters a turbine, and this turbine has a